What's up? I'm just going to show off my <clears throat> Nightmare on Elm Street VHS collection I got down here. These were the very first releases they ever came out on. And I got three copies of Freddy's Dead, The Final Nightmare. This is the RCA Columbia version I just showed off. I don't know if you, you can't see it very good here, but it says right here on the side, RCA Columbia. Those of you who are Nightmare on Elm Street fans already know what I mean. And Freddy's Dead, The Final Nightmare, they saved the best for last. And some people might wonder why I got another one like that, because this was a Turner Home Entertainment reissue, as you can see there. Looks a little bit beat up right there on the side, but the box is in great condition. It's got the Turner Home logo down there, too, instead of RCA, I believe. Um, uh, what do you call it? I believe... I think um, Turner Home Entertainment bought out New Line. I could be wrong. I heard that, but, you know, I don't know if that's true or not. As you can see, it's got a Turner Home Entertainment logo right there. Tape only has, like, the Turner Home Entertainment intro at the beginning, and it's only got the deep cover preview on it. It doesn't have the Freddy's Dead 1-800-964-FRED number, like the RCA Columbia one had over there. And this is weird. It doesn't say what year this one was issued. Not on the tape or anything. <clears throat> and another copy of Freddy's Dead, The Final Nightmare. This was actually a re-release in 1996. Yep, it says 1996 New Line Home Entertainment. I can put this phone down right here. Yeah, it says 1996. Yep, 1996. This one has a little bit of a writing on the VHS there. <laughs> and I have two copies of Wes Craven's New Nightmare. Um, one's the Special Collector's Edition. And the other one is not. The difference is the picture of Freddy right here is not in bus like it is on the Special Collector's Edition. Freddy's actually in bust. You can actually feel the knives in his face and everything, but on this one you can. It's just a regular cover. And this one does not have the Turner Home Entertainment logo like the Special Collector's Edition does, but the box is exactly the same, same artwork and everything. It does have a uh, Turner Home Entertainment tape, just like that one does. This one's the same, except it's in the picture of Freddy's and Bust, and the side is the same, except it's got the, well, there's a sticker over that. It's got a Turner Home Entertainment logo right there. Yep, it's exactly the same. So I just thought I'd show off my Nightmare on Elm Street VHS collection. Alrighty, and that's it.